in the conservation of biodiversity and its relation to hunger reduction. We have to acknowledge firstly the continued connection to the land that Indigenous peoples have, not just in Australia but broadly. Uh, the, the spiritual relationship that Indigenous peoples have with those species uh, and those landscapes. And draw from those examples and those experiences uh, best practices that have um, been utilised for, for, for quite some time. The challenges of Indigenous youth in Asia is predominantly culture. With the loss of cultural expression, with the loss of traditional knowledge, and also with the loss of the uh, availability of vehicles to transmit traditional knowledge form in safe spaces is why indigenous youth in Asia feel that culture is the number one issue. Indigenous youth face many challenges like a, a lack of land rights, effects of climate change and a, a invasion of rangelands by unwanted species of pastures. We also face a, a problems like a desertification and a degradation of the land. The challenges that Indigenous youth oftentimes face is um, struggling with passing on traditional knowledge. Um, for instance, youth are, tend to move out of the traditional areas where the Indigenous people live, and so uh, sometimes they lose language, they lose their connection with their family. Myself, I have a role to play within my community. And that role is to ensure that those practices continue, not just for myself or my children, but for their children. Today, indigenous peoples can help achieve zero hunger is by receiving and using the entitlement of their traditional knowledge, which have come from their generation after generation, who have been plowing the land for thousands of years. Indigenous youth can make so many contributions by, first of all, uh, starting to do modern uh, grazing methods where they have to stay on a piece of land and then graze on the piece of land. They also have to propagate new pastures like the uh, Bracaria, the Guatemala and other uh, new species of grass. They should also uh, learn new adaptation and uh, mitigation strategies to climate change. And they should also advocate for customary and community land rights uh, recognition in uh, all the countries in Africa. For instance, in my area, uh, Sami youth are um, starting to organize courses on traditional knowledge that are made by youth for the youth. So uh, it's also created like new kinds of solutions to the problem. We want to be hard. We feed the world. Let's do it together. <laughs>